like they know me But you don't really know me What's poppin' T-Squad? Welcome back to the Rush Fam! Welcome, Welcome back, back to, to another, another vlog! Hey, hey we're back guys. Cool. Yeah, man. What's up, baby? Little, well, I guess we had not long break, but you know, we took a few days off, you know? Felt yeah. really good. But we back. We back. Better than ever. Had a little yeah. holiday yesterday. Yesterday was Canada Day. Mm -hmm. So, you know, we just had a relaxing day. But you guys, we have a few things to show you guys that we haven't shown you guys yet. So, before we start this video, make sure you guys smash that thumbs up right now for giving you guys a lip vlog. And make sure you subscribe because if, if you ain't with the squad, squad you, you ain't popping. Poppin'. Definitely gonna want to be popping on this video. Yep. So, you guys, y'all know that we did the house tour. Actually, two house tours. It took us two videos to show you guys our completely renovated house. Yep. Y'all know that we pretty much like went from top to bottom or bottom to top and redid the whole house. But there is actually two rooms that we never really three. showed. Three rooms. Three. But we're only showing you two today. Two. So three rooms we never showed you guys. Secret rooms. Yeah. It's not like a big secret, but we just never showed y'all. And it's also rooms that like people when they come over to our house, they don't usually get to see either. Exactly. So there are secret rooms. Mm -hmm. But you know what we realized? Like we first of all we vlogged in there. We've taken pictures in there. Yeah. So it's like every time we take a picture or vlog, everyone's like, wait, what, what is, is that? that? Room? Yeah, we never exactly. saw it on the tour. We weren't going to, but we're just like, ah, whatever. Like, but you know what? You know, and it's complete now too. Both rooms are complete. So that's yeah. another reason why too. So But y'all family, so y'all getting the inside scoop. Mm -hmm. Y'all about to see the, the rooms we never showed on the house tour. Yo, you ready? I'm ready. So we're in our bathroom right now, y'all, and the first room is on the other side of our bathroom. You would think that our bedroom would be on the other side of our bathroom, but, but it's not. So let's go. So this is our walk-in closet. closet. Hey, <laughs> this room brings a smile to my face, you guys. This was like, okay, I feel like, I said this to you before, babe, but just gotta tell y'all on the vlog too. I feel like this room mm -hmm. or this closet is like the ultimate vision coming to life in terms of our house. You know, yeah. the house went really good overall, but this room was like, we broke down walls. We had, it did not look, this Nothing didn't even Nothing like exist. it. So this I know, we, so we, I know we said a little bit in the, in the house tour before how we broke down walls and stuff like that. Yeah. And if you guys watched the first house tour, back here was two closets and it was pretty much tiny though. Yeah, tiny it was closets. this back section back here. So one so closet was like from here to, to here. there. Then there was a wall here. A thick wall. And then it was from here to here. And literally the whole closet was like it, it wasn't like this, yeah, or? it wasn't this high and every it was just it was so different. It was tiny. So then as we started getting into the renovations and stuff, I'm like, "Wait a second. We already said we don't want that closet, which is the other side of this room there was a and there was a hallway there. yeah there was an office over there a hallway mm -hmm. a closet in that office and in that hallway I think we were like pretending to like jump out and like pretend we're changing looks and stuff like that and there were mirrors so I was like babe if all goes well we can pretty much break down this wall and break down the walls that were connecting our two closets mm -hmm. and make it one big closet and then just shut off the door and that's what so we did. it all went well like you know the engineers or the architects or whoever they all made sure that whatever structure we needed to get out of the way to make this happen. We had to bring in a beam like they had to bring in like a structural beam in the ceiling Just to make sure like everything holds up, right? Mm -hmm. But anyways, that's pretty much the process and like how we thought of turning this into one big room Which we did and then we went ahead and designed it together um, You know half and half as much as possible, I guess and then everything else so Let's get into it. All right, so one of the first things that you guys will notice when you walk in is that we have this huge island in the middle of our closet. Yo, this island taller than me, babe. I'm 6'2", and this this got like at least... I think it's seven or eight, eight. feet. It's at least eight feet. This island's huge, yo. And then um, on we have drawers on both sides, so nine drawers on both sides here. And mm. of course, we had to put a nice countertop on it. Um, I have to put my perfumes here because Kira just goes in the bathroom and knocks everything down so until I find a better place that's what's up here's a picture from our from my birthday in Dubai we went on that mm -hmm. boat cruise right yep. um, just candle flowers and then which section should we start on let's start let's start here yeah the shoe the shoe area the shoe area so y'all know we we're had a sneaker shoe room heads. in the last house yeah we had a shoe room but okay so we're sneaker heads but lately I don't know we're feeling like we don't wear a lot of them so we're kind of thinking about what we should do with all our shoes but anyways, this is our shoes. Um, we have shoes also in the basement. We have like a slight 
slight problem, but we have a slight problem still. You know, we're constantly like donating a lot of them, giving them away, but you know, we're, we love our shoes. So we needed to have floor to ceiling shoe area. Um, there's like unopened ones up. It's, you know, it's all over the place. Right? It's all over the place. <laughs> so this side is my side. This side is Trey's side. And then there's a mixture of both of our shoes in here. And it's actually deep enough that you can stack two pairs of shoes behind. Well, I don't know. Your your feet are a lot bigger than mine. Yeah, so I don't, I sometimes could, you can, sometimes like you can't. So um, that's that there. Um, shout out to my like one row of heels. I don't know where the rest are. I think, <laughs> I think some of them are like in there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's a few in there. Next up though, one thing that we both said we absolutely needed in here was a huge floor to ceiling mirror. Obviously being that like we're our career social media, we wanna make sure we look good. We wanna yeah. be able to take good pictures. And it's just cool to have a big mirror in your closet. And and also, so, wait, wait, yeah. do you remember we did a house tour when we were gonna buy a pre-construction house? Mm -hmm. And the inspiration from that is how we came up with this. Nah, I don't remember that. What? Were you with me? I don't think so. Yeah, you were there. Maybe, I don't remember that though. Anyways, there was a walk-in <laughs> closet, there was a mm -hmm. mirror, and the TV was on the mirror. So that's yeah. what we did. Yo, we, we had to like, We were like, we had right to do it, exactly. So yo, we're gonna pause the tour <laughs> for so a minute. Excited. I'm gonna tell you guys something. And babe, you could vouch for me here. So we knew we had to get the TV and the mirror. And yo, this this room, this closet, whatever you want to call it, it's kind of turned into like one of my like sanctuaries in the house. A lot of times you'll be looking for me. The kids will be looking for me. I'm literally in here with all the doors shut, watching music videos, vibing, folding laundry, and I'll be in here for like an hour or two at once. I'll even pour myself a drink and just sit up here and you know what, just chill, watch my show or whatever. Yeah, you used to do that a lot before. Lately, yeah. not as much, because obviously like we're really busy now and whatnot, but yeah. a lot of times I'm like, why aren't you chilling out here with us, like, why are you in here all by yourself? And you're like, I'm just vibing, I'm just, you know, whatever. So, yeah, who's that on the TV right now? Ah, <laughs> Kiki. So, yeah, floor to ceiling mirror. Um, this is with dope the TV, too. and that's a yeah, that's a vent. They tried to disclose, try to hide it as best possible, or and just make it look us. appealing. You know yeah, what I'm right. Yeah. All right. Now, moving on to the next section, we have the bag and purse area <laughs> and backpack area. <laughs> bag experience. It's the bags. So. I'm not gonna lie. There was a little, there was a little bit of back and forth on this section because you know I wanted an area for my purses. You, hold on, just don't back and forth. <laughs> Be honest. The truth is, you try to take over the whole thing. I try. Well, and I'm the one that planned this area of the things because I'm like, okay, I have no, my purses. We both planned the whole. They need closet. somewhere to go. Right. Yeah, but I needed a, a purse section. I'm like, I need a purse section. But I needed. So a that's what section. this. Okay. <laughs> I, got, I got backpacks and duffel bags. Anyways, so I was like, I need a place for my purses and whatnot. And let's be honest, all my purses aren't filling up this space. But I tried to be like, okay, you can have, you know, this side and this no, and no, that. No, 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 no. You tried to tell me I would only get up there. Yes, yes, that's, that's true. That's what you tried to tell me. <laughs> You're like, yo, babe. That's true, that's true. You're like, true. you're tall. You can just have all up there. I'm like, so I can't have nothing within arm's reach? And you're like, nah. I'm like, Well, yo, that's nah, only that's because you were teasing me. You're like, yo, well, I'm tall. So if there's something up there and you can't reach it, you got to get the ladder. Okay, so it's like, true. if I need the ladder for something, then you can reach up there since you're so tall. Okay, so. But anyways, <laughs> I gave on. in because it was looking a little bit empty. Like, I don't have that many purses. Nah, you knew it. You were being yeah, unfair. Yeah, okay. This is what you he did. He moved my stuff to the corner put his stuff there and he's like this part is mine and I was just like all right fine whatever like I wasn't trying to argue anymore at that point but we're you know done. you know we're sharing the whole closet like if it was only my closet and he tried to put something in then like in, or vice versa I'd be like okay you know what are you doing but it's our closet it's a so joint closet. you know so and anyways it's filling out nicely with the backpacks there so you know yeah yeah, yeah. But <laughs> speaking of being too short to reach stuff let's see how high up we could go we could get something without using the ladder oh so now it's a height right. challenge so yo see if you can get a shoe from this right there I can just like that let's see if you can can you get one go this for it really supposed to be like i'm not dissing you let's just you're see how, dissing. You're, you how am i dissing? dissing nah okay now let's go next row up look how look how high my arm All already right. went i can get mine no problem try to get yours oh you climbing wow that's what you do to get up there <laughs> All right, next one here. Next one up. No. Yeah, come you're on. You're gonna jump. You're gonna here. No jumping. Take the allowed. camera. What? What do you mean? No, you're clapping. No clapping. jumping. Take the camera. No jumping. All right, next one. See? <laughs> oh, 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 struggle. That's what you get. <laughs> okay, cool. I can get the next one. Huh? Let's see you get this row now. No. Huh? Let's see. I don't want to climb anymore. Nah. All right. So, 
That brings me to this, y'all. If you walked in here and you're like, yo, why the heck do they have a ladder in their closet? This is why. Here you go, baby. Thank you. Here you Thank go. you very much. <sighs> well, I'm up here. Do you want anything? Um, Too bad. Actually, I'm, I might take over your top row. Your top row is pretty empty right there. Mm, I do have shoes downstairs. <laughs> Just in case you try to take over. Look, you still have space. You have like space in the corners of yours. Yeah, I got a little space. Okay. But you guys, okay, so in terms of why everything goes all the way to the top, when we were designing this closet, we realized there's no point in having dead, dead space. space. Like if you have it, an area and let's say we ended it at the top of like our arm's length or whatever, it would just be empty, wasted Catch space. Us, so yeah. may as well fill in all the dead space. And we actually have on the other side, which we're gonna get into right now. Yes, this is where our hanging clothes are. This divider pretty much separates my side from your side. From my clothes, and um, there's just like a few different sections. So this is like long, tall, long hanging, whatever you want to call it. Mm -hmm. um, and there's double hanging in here, but these go all the way back. I don't know how far you guys can see, but it goes all the way back. All the yep. way back there. Same with the bottom section here. Mm -hmm. um, so this goes all the way to the back there. Yep, and then we have another nice big section here and then we just got these in recently because we felt like what's the point of having like hanging 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 when we need jeans so no we had to have our pant hangers yeah, and this one you could fit like two to three jeans yeah, per exactly per so thing you know what i'm saying slide it down you still have extra space mm -hmm. another hanging section here and then we have two drawers, drawers and then laundry bins are in here in that's one thing we really wanted we didn't want to have no laundry i saw just like a around. basket sitting there so it still happens in. sometimes when we're neglecting to fold it and this and that <laughs> <laughs> but for the most part, our laundry goes in those two right there. Yes. So that's pretty dope. And Kisha's then side is the same. Same exact thing. And then, but then up top. Up top, we have our out of season clothes, but I don't think we put them away because we still have sweaters hanging all over. I got the stuff up there. Yeah, I have I have sweaters up there too, but I'm saying like, I think I, I still have a sweater problem. You guys, we talked about this like years ago. Mm -hmm. I'm trying to get over it. But, um, <laughs> Hold know, on, babe. Can it's you... hard to let go. It's super hard to <laughs> let go. Yo, we all have our, um, our weakness. Yes. I don't know what to call it, but yeah. babe. Serious question. I'm not trying to like make fun of you. Can you can open? You reach it? Can you open up there without climbing? Uh, oh my gosh. Uh, uh, <laughs> You're super. Oh, she's climbing. Uh, okay. <laughs> so the ladder definitely gets put to good use. Um, that's pretty much the whole closet. Oh, we got some artwork. Oh, what we did talk about is which what? obviously you guys can see the way the closet is lit up is the lighting the guys that helped us design it had a crazy idea and he's like yo we can throw some led rods in there so everywhere that has hanging clothes has led rods everywhere and where our shoes and the bags are they light up from the side yeah. So they're like in the wall. Ooh, these are the comfiest heels ever. <laughs> Shout out Jennifer Shout Lee. Shout out to Jennifer Lee, girl. Listen. And she's local Toronto talent too. Yes. Yeah, local Poppin'. Toronto entrepreneur. But um, Shout yeah, these, these um shine like back. So like yeah. the whole thing lights up. So I don't know how. You guys know I don't wear heels like that. These heels are like, as you can see, they're tiny. Mm -hmm. I don't know how these heels are so comfortable. I need to, I need to go somewhere, babe. <laughs> we need to, we need to get on a date. Right. That's the thing. Like all our stuff is catching dust, you know, because everyone's home. But best believe, we're gonna be going out more than ever when everything opens back up. Oh, for sure. Time to put some use into all our belongings. Are there any favorite shoes that you want to show, babe? Like the nah. one for your birthday. This is not a shoe collection like, video. Like the one I got you for your birthday? You, you want to show He wants to show you guys these. <laughs> these are the self, I got Trey these self-lacing shoes and he let them die. I'm not used to charging shoes yet. <laughs> I'm not used to it. It's gonna, it's gonna not say grow on me, but I'm gonna get used to it. I gotta come home and put it on the charger when I'm done wearing it. But that's the closet, y'all. We also have, I wanna show you this piece of artwork. Um, we're gonna be hanging art in here. We're super slow with hanging our artwork. But our friend Mikey, um, Mikey the artist on Instagram, shout out to him. He made this for us. This is gonna go what? Right there, right there? It's gonna go right there. But also, this is gonna go right there. Sure, like, even just all around the house, wanna make sure like it fits. Like, you know, we're finding the right beams and stuff like that and the right stuff to hang. We don't wanna just put it up prematurely. This piece is heavy, exactly. This one's so super we need, heavy. Like, we need some thick, <sighs> we need some thick nails. Nails to go in and Facts. probably the brackets with it so it doesn't break the drywall and stuff. But yeah. Facts. But yeah, you guys, that's our closet. Like, I 
obviously we're, we're not naive to the fact that it's a crazy closet. This is something we always wanted. We always wanted to have a sick closet. We love getting fresh together. But you guys, for everyone watching this, y'all know we post these things for motivational purposes. You guys gotta remember that literally this closet, it was, was like the size of some of our first apartments. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So like, yo, it took us years and years and years to work towards this, but yeah. anything is possible, y'all. Like motivational purposes me, only. You know, to all the go-getters out there, this was dream a dream big. and we made it happen. You dream know what I'm saying? Big. That being said, we're gonna go and show you guys the second secret room of this vlog. And this yeah. one, we gotta go Ooh. downstairs into the basement. Let's go. Let's go. Hey, Nipsey, what's up, bro? What's up, bro? What's up to the vlog, Nip? What's going on? <laughs> what, you knew I was gonna say that? You really want him to say what's up? Yeah, he's gonna say it soon. I'm training him. All right, y'all, so we came downstairs as you saw. This room we're about to go in, you guys have seen it, but way before it was near finished. We've done so much to it. Like you said, it is now pretty much complete. Yeah. We're gonna show you the updated secret theater room, y'all. Let's go. Nipsey, you coming for the tour, bro? You coming for the tour? All right, y'all, here is the major update. If you guys remember, we showed you this room before. We had like some bean bags in here, I think. Yeah, two big, two bean, big bags. bean bags. All we had. We went ahead and got some custom chairs. Shout out to Jacqueline, Spaces by Jack Flash. Making it happen. Yes, I we, showed yo, her. We babe, what would we have done without Jacqueline, bro? Honestly, I, I don't yo, know. Lifesaver. She She's saved a huge us lifesaver. In many ways. I showed her my inspo picture that I found mm -hmm. on Pinterest, and I was pretty much like, I wanted to be as close to this as possible. Yeah. We still threw in some things that are our own, but. Yeah. So, you know, we have these custom couches here. She helped me pick out the material and mm -hmm. everything. And the dope thing is, as you go back row by row, it's raised up. So this one sits lower, so this second row is higher. But then the back row, they actually, as we said, they're custom. They built them taller. Yeah, they so each row, higher. you can see over the row in front of you like yeah. a real movie theater. So yeah, <clears throat> got these custom couches made with the help of Jacqueline. Mm -hmm. um, she also helped source these theater lights, which I think are so perfect. It's like that real theater vibe. Theater vibe. It's, it shines from the top and the bottom. Uh -huh. And then this was supposed to be a dead corner. It was really just going in like a triangle and we're like, no, nah. we need to use this space somehow. No dead space. So the no guys, dead space. Um, same guys that did the closet, they put in these shelves once again with the LED strips. Mm -hmm. um, and then when we were getting our countertops, we're like, might as well put a nice countertop on here and make it look, you know, a little bit fancy. Uh huh. And then in here, we just have like our AV unit Equipment. and our subwoofer, um, Xbox. And, yep. you know, we come down here and watch movies. Play Boom. Fortnite and Gears of War and whatever else we want to play and just vibe like yo this is like my next hideaway spot when y'all looking yes. for me I'm usually in here if I'm not in, in the closet upstairs I'll be down here oh yeah um, and we have the surround sound system yeah so we have the speakers mounted on the back here yeah we have two tower speakers in here it's, you would never think anything is in here you just think it's fancy when you yeah pop these out boom more speakers and, um, there's a speaker in here and there's one more on the other side At every TV you every TV you go to in the house you know or this one's a projector obviously the yeah. projectors right there but and then one this more is usually what's on the TV you feel me got to run up them views mm -hmm. yeah and then I got one more speaker in the middle one more speaker and then we just gotta find like some theater vibe decorations to put inside these shelves I want to put a popcorn machine well we put that in the back yeah 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 so yeah and then we got these Ottomans too uh-huh so yeah when we first got these couches we were thinking about putting some bean bags in the front but then I was like nah it'll be nice to kick up your feet and whatnot yeah but the first time I sat in these I was like I'm like oh like <laughs> She, she designed the couches to be so nice and deep that like yeah. you barely, well I guess you will because you're longer than me. Like, you can't, oh, barely, you're saying, hold on, you can barely reach. That's what you're trying to say. <laughs> no, I'm saying you barely need it. Because you mean, can like, barely reach. Okay, there's a space here. I can pull it in, but yeah. it looks nicer like this. But when I sit though, you're right. With me, it's more like a thing. Well, you still my have feet... to scoot, like your butt's not even all the way back. Scoot your butt back a little it bit. Is. See? Yeah. But then look, look at our ankles. <laughs> you look so small in that I, couch. You'll just, <laughs> This couch sinks you in. Yeah. But honestly, it's so comfy. Like, this is what was missing. I don't know if we'll ever hang up art in here. I like it how it is. Nah, it's a theater room. You know, you're not really supposed to have art. You know, but look at, like our favorite Right? Look at those two cute kids right there. Aww, who, who that? They who look that? so familiar. Let's see what they're up to, y'all. Hey. 
Hey, um, come down to the theater room. We're trying to show what's up, and you guys aren't even in the vlog. Okay, come on, Joe, let's go. Okay, bye. <laughs> hey, T-Squad wants to see y'all, bye. Bye. But yeah, another thing, babe. I hate exposing my, my lovely dog, but where's he at? Nipsey, there, there he is, babe. Let's talk about why Nipsey's not supposed to be in here. <sighs> Nipsey. Nipsey. Nipsey is not supposed to be in here because We'll all be chilling, vibing, you know, relaxing, and then all we smell is something rank, and I know it's Nipsey. <laughs> Yo, Hi. what's up, Meryl? Welcome to the vlog. What's up? We're just talking about how Nipsey farts in this theater and it stinks up the theater for like an hour. And, it and then, yo, that's the thing about his farts, y'all. It stays in this room. Something about it, it stays in the room for like an hour. So Nipsey, this is one of the few rooms Nipsey's not really allowed to be in. But right now, right now he's in here, but that's not the usual. What's up, Callie? Welcome what? to the vlog. You guys good? Yeah. yeah. Say what's up yeah. to T Squad, man. What's up? Hey. What's up? Yo, another thing, babe. Yeah. Since we're like just airing out all of our dirty laundry right now, come here. Yeah. Come here, bro. Yeah. Before we got these couches, yeah. what was our favorite thing to do in here? Wrestle! But babe, are we allowed to wrestle in here anymore? No, you are not allowed to wrestle. What, what about just one body slam? Here, hold the camera, no, babe. No. Callie, hold the camera. Just one body slam? One body slam, bro. But anyways. This used to be like our wrestling room. Now we're not allowed to wrestle in here no more. But Callie, what do you think about the theater room? You love it down here? Yeah! Oh my gosh, stop the screaming. Hey, hey, I see you, Callie. Hey. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Anyways, babe, that pretty much sums up the secret room. Yeah, we reveal. do have one more, but we still haven't. There's things that weren't finished from the rental that need to be finished in that room, so. I don't even know what room you're talking about. The office. Oh, the second yeah. office. Yes. So yeah, we do have one more room. We may show you guys at a later date. But anyways, smash the thumbs up if you guys enjoyed the Secret Rooms tour. But right now, you guys, the vlog's not done. I actually have a very fun surprise for Callie and Camaro. So, 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 so. You guys ready to have some fun or what? Yeah! All right, let's go, let's go upstairs. What is it? A surprise is a surprise. Okay, okay. Oh, I guess this is getting a surprise too. <laughs> hi. Hi, T-Squad. <laughs> the T squad. She wants to go, wanna outside. go outside. Kira. Kiki, Kira. say T squad. Callie, what you doing, girl? Oh yeah, my so gosh. These balloons are from Callie's kindergarten. Graduation. Kinderwear, kindergarten graduation. graduation. We had like the smallest thing ever, and then as soon as we done take pictures, she was over it. So <laughs> that's that. Now we're yeah. they're turning into punching bags. Anyways, hold on, you guys. Hold on, hold on. We're trying to see. We're trying to see if Kira will say T squad. Kira, say T squad. Say T squad. She's a She wants this that I'm holding. Pass this. Say T squad. Pizza. Oh. Pizza. Oh. <laughs> That's the closest like she ever been though. Yo, on a, on a completely different subject. <laughs> um, <laughs> so I was like reading up on like Kira's development and her milestones, right? Yeah. Hit hit this. Yeah, so I was reading up on her milestones and her development. Oh, yeah. And apparently, because I'm like, Kira knows way so much, like she knows so many words. Yeah. So apparently she's supposed to know between like 20 and 50. Mm -hmm. And then me and you started counting on the weekend. How many words she knows. And she knows well over 100. So like, we think Kira's like, obviously we know she's super advanced, but like on yeah. the next level, like we gonna have to like, I don't know, Put like a baby Einstein course or something like, I don't know. It looks like she just found a new hobby too. Kira, are you gonna be a baseball player? Are you gonna play baseball? So Kiki, big up yourself. Big up yourself, Kiki. Yeah. Hey. Oh my gosh, she wants to go outside and play. Anyways, I told y'all I have a small little surprise for you guys, so y'all stay here, all right? Whoa. That didn't even do anything. You gotta keep going till you get it, bro. What's up? Two hands, two yeah, hands. Two hands, two hands. Let me show you the proper form, all right? Look. Ready? What? Better up, better up. You knock it on the park, all right? Two oh, hands. Oh, I felt that one. Oh, oh, seven came out, keep going. One more? You're getting close. This 
All right, so in the last video, y'all know that we as a family painted my Range Rover. And to be honest, yo, a lot of people were very upset that I did that. Like when I posted it on my Instagram, there were so much people very upset as if I just ruined a perfectly good car. What was the caption again? You were like, I was like, how do you, you like think? it? Yeah, how do you like it? How do you like it? People were like, oh, I could have used that car. Everyone was so mad, but we were saying that it's washable paint. Like, come on now. Yo, people were acting like I legit ruined my Range Rover. Um, okay. So it was fully covered in paint. This is how much is left y'all. We have a little bit here. We have a little bit on the sides. Uh, we have some right here. The wheels still have a whole bunch. But anyways, we just pulled up to a car wash and I'm gonna try to get off the rest. So anyways, moment of truth, you're about to see, babe. Let's see. T-Squad, leave a comment right now. Do you think my car is ruined or do you think this last bit of paint has come off? Also, just so you know, it came off this much so far just in a little bit of rain and I took it for one car wash, but like the automatic car wash. So I'm about to wash it by hand and see what happens. It's hot today, babe. You want a little cool off? No, babe. Nah, you good? Uh-oh. Wow. Yo, why is it not coming off, man? I don't know. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. No, -oh. uh -oh. babe, I might have messed up. This part looks like it's in there, in there, like. Yo, the haters might have been right, babe. If this doesn't do it, if this doesn't do it, I'm screwed. So, by the looks of it, everything looks proper. Ooh. I was a little bit worried at first, but everything looks good. Right? Everything looks good. Right? Everything looks good. Okay, well, it's getting darker as we go back here, but... Yeah, it's good. It's good. You guys are going for a walk? Yeah, you're going for a walk. Also, T-Squad, we have a little, small little house update to show y'all. We got a new little park with some new swings for the kids. This one actually is mostly for Kira because this is her size. Are you gonna go in your park? Kiki, Kira, Kira, are you ignoring me? Uh. Wow, you're ignoring me? Wow. Do you wanna go down the slide? Let's see you go down the slide. And she climbs this herself like a big girl, but right now she's holding candy, so see how it goes. Kira, are you a big girl? <laughs> Say big girl. Big girl. Wow. What do you think, Nipsey? Can she do it? Yeah? Uh. All right, let's see you do it, girl. You got it? Ah, let's see. Go down the slide. <laughs> let's see, girl. Sit. Sit and go down. Want me to give you a countdown? No. Five, four, three, two, one, go. You just going to chill up there? And where'd you get this, girl? Where'd you get the yeah. Give me this. Oh, my gosh. Meryl, talk Can to your I sister. Go? Coming. Yeah. Ah, Kira, let's see you go down. All right, here she goes, you guys. She finally decided to go. Let's see, go down. Uh huh. <laughs> let's see, Kira. Oh, you see, you're doing the countdown. Four, three, two, one, go. Go, Kira. Are you going down or not? <laughs> Anyways, you guys. Oh, wow. Wow. As soon as I walk away. That's when you're gonna go? <laughs> That's when you're gonna go? What are you on right now, Kiki? Are you pranking me? Literally, as soon as I walk away and say she's not gonna go, she goes. Anyways, yeah, that's a little park update. Also, T-Squad, I got a super big family update to show you. Look at Camaro's mustache. Look at that. <laughs> Camaro, can I see your mustache? Come on, bro. Let me see your mustache. Can I please see your mustache? Why, bro? Kira, your brother won't let me see his mustache. No. Why, Kira? No. Okay. Yeah? You can only see if you buy me a whole bunch of Robux. I can only see your mustache if what? If you if you buy me a whole bunch of Robux. Then you'll let me see your mustache? Yeah. Is it real? Deal. Okay. Let me see. Hold on, come in the sun. <laughs> Back up a little bit. Go over here. Over here. Why? So I, I can like, see in the light. So they can be on your back. Huh? He's like behind your back. You guys, look at his mustache. What's behind your back? This one's yeah, yeet. That means I don't have to buy you no no Roblox. Roblox. <laughs> <laughs> ah! Ah! Oh, Who's that? Dad, dad abuse. Dad, oh! It's dad abuse. Stay away. I might I might buy you a small pack of Roblox. 
You guys, Camaro's always very embarrassed when I talk about his mustache, but in a cute way. He doesn't actually care, but this guy is turning into a little man already, T-Squad. 10 years old, growing a little mustache. Where did my baby boy go, man? Time flies. Which is why me and Keisha are always saying you gotta live in the moment. Time flies, y'all. And that's something you really notice when you become a parent. When you see your kids growing up, that's when you start to feel like time. It just goes quick, man. It's crazy. Hey, go where the rocks are, where the grass is. Come here, what are you doing right now? Um, we're finding a pot of gold. You're finding a pot of gold? Yep. How? We're following where the rainbow is. <laughs> it's, it's over that way. Oh my gosh. Turn, turn this way. Hey, tell me if you see the rainbow, look. Oh yeah, I see the rainbow. But I don't know if there's gonna be a pot of gold for this rainbow, Camilla. I know where exactly where it ends. Where? Camilla, help me. <laughs> <laughs> got him. Camilla, I got you, bro. What's up, Keeks? What's up, girl? You wanna go into Water Castle? All right, T-Squad, I think I'm gonna end all this vlog so we can put the camera down and enjoy the last bit of sunlight before the sun goes down. As we've been saying lately, it's just another beautiful day here in Toronto. You guys know I couldn't go a whole vlog without telling you how beautiful it is outside. And yeah, we're gonna set up the Jumpy Castle. Nipsey, what are you saying, bro? You wanna get wet? You wanna get wet? You wanna get wet? Huh? Don't do that to Camaro. Don't do what? Peace. Don't do what to Camaro? Don't put water on him before I put water on you. And and then I'm gonna push you into the bushes. So you're, you're riding out for your brother? But Camille always gets me. I had to get him back for payback. It's all love, y'all. I'm about to get wet with you guys anyways. But yeah, T-Squad, if you made it to the end of the video and you enjoyed it, make sure you smash the thumbs up. And if you're not subscribed, make sure you subscribe because if you ain't with the squad, you ain't popping. And we will see you guys in the next video. We out, T-Squad.